Since the invention of the telescope, astronomers have been observing the sun and logging the formation and dissipation of sunspots, eventually realizing that the more spots means more solar activity, but also noticing that the sun has cycles of these active periods that could last ages. But recently, a team of researchers decided they wanted to look back in time further than the 400 years ago when man first started looking through a magnified instrument at the sun, and they did so by looking at trees. The team of researchers from the laboratory of ion beam physics at ETH Zurich looked at the radioactive carbon concentrations in tree rings. Trees grow in a cycle that are about a year long, so each ring of a tree is like a time capsule of its experiences that year, which includes small amounts of radioactive carbon-14. By analyzing that tree ring data and knowing that carbon-14 has a half-life of 5,700 years, researchers can tell how much C-14 was in the atmosphere when the ring grew. And the more C-14 in the tree rings, which actually comes from outside our solar system, the less C-14 rays the sun's magnetic field could block, meaning there was less solar activity at that particular time. And the researchers were able to track solar sunspot activity back 969 years, 569 years earlier than the first telescope equipped man.